I'm surprised Sarah's judge granted the request that her lawyer quit. Did? Wait, did he? The seventh lawyer? I have not looked at that yet to see if the judge granted or anything. I know they're supposed to do a status hearing in May because they want the trial to happen in May. What? Wait, a conflict attorney has been appointed? What does that mean? I didn't expect this. I thought the judge was going to be like, you know what, Mr. Winston, just deal with it just a little bit more, just a little bit more. She's on her seventh attorney now, but no, they granted it. I mean, I guess that's good. Maybe, maybe he went into more details about what the irreconcilable differences were. Oh my goodness. All right, y'all, hold on a second. Sarah Boone first. Oh, hold on, no. <laughs> and then another motion to withdraw on February 5th. Oh, did he have to include more details? Now, if you guys haven't seen it already, I made a video about Sarah Boone's recent letter complaining about her seventh attorney. I thought they were doing good. I thought they were getting along. I, I think it's just because I assumed they were. It seems like they were meeting, things were happening. You know, sometimes when I popped in here, things were updating. They were trying to get experts and all that stuff, but no, uh, they were not getting along, I guess. Or Sarah's complaining that she hasn't had much time to spend with her newest lawyer. I think he spent, according to her, by the way, according to her, she spent about three and a half hours with him on like one of the first meetings. And then after that, he kind of ghosted her. But that's according to her. Who knows? She could be lying. Oh man, take your time, Corgi. We'll get Donna to sue when we get to Donna Sue. <laughs> Tell me about the suitcase, Sarah Buffoon. <laughs> Some of you guys should be poets, okay? Is there anything where the court can just say, nah, enough, enough, enough? I, I assume that's where it would be heading, but this is a new judge overseeing this. We have Judge Kranick now, not Judge Wooten. So maybe Judge Kranick is like, you know what? All right, I'm gonna grant it just this one time, you know, and let's see how it goes. Let's see how it is. Ugh. Court this morning to ask that her case. Oh, okay, okay, hold on. Sorry, what, this, what is this UI? <laughs> All right. Winter Park woman accused of leaving boyfriend in suitcase to die gets a new lawyer. Someone did mention that that was her fiance. Does anyone know if they were just boyfriend, girlfriend, or were they slated to get married? I've been here for four years and I'm tired of being here. I'm tired of going through all of these attorneys, which are not my fault. I know for sure. I'm pretty fucking confident that she's going to testify. I'm very confident she's going to testify. They say she left her boyfriend, George Torres Jr., zipped up in a suitcase after a game of hide and seek and recorded him begging for help. And remember, it's not her fault, she says. It is not her fault. She's on her seventh attorney. Ugh. Seemingly all of your relationships with counsel have deteriorated. I would say Ms. Boone has some ideas about what should be done, should not be done. Don't agree with those. Some things she wants done, they won't do. But when 100 days have passed and I haven't heard or said or done anything other than trying to figure out where you are because your phone doesn't work, I'm not a bad person because of that. The judge gave Boone a new lawyer but did not push back the trial, which is currently set to start. Oh, is that her new lawyer right there? In May. Okay, loving the attire, the loving the glasses, loving the hair. I wish I could wear hair like that. I wish my hair was like that naturally. I do have curly hair naturally, though, but it doesn't look as voluptuous. Um, I kind of wish they would just show the entire, <laughs> the entire thing. I think it's just, a, okay. If I can find the entire thing, I'm going to play the entire thing. Because I just want, I don't know, I just want to watch the entire thing. I don't want, like, another recap of it. All right, well, Sarah Boone, new attorney. She's on her eighth attorney now, and we'll see how things go. We'll see how things go. She thinks she's difficult. They would just let her go. Maybe at some point she'll complain in like appeals and say that, hey, my case was ridiculous. I went through so many attorneys because they were so incompetent. Da, 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 da. I didn't have time to prepare for my case fully because no one would, no one would update me. No one would let me show up at the court appearances. You know, maybe people were ignoring my meetings. I don't know. I don't know if that's like the route that she's going to go where she's like, I've been sitting in jail for four years and blah, 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 blah. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Sorry. Oh, the sizing for this is all funky. Um, there you go. Sorry about that.